Hello friends, welcome back to our channel. So in today's session, we'll see the one more option in PowerPoint that is how to insert the text on slides. So in the previous session, we have seen about the layout of a slide and the design of a slide. So now we'll see the how to insert the text for the slides. So first I will go with the layout. I will take the blank layout and go with the design. I will take some sort of design here. And these are the variants uh, which we have discussed in the previous session. So I will go with this design. Okay. And now I want to insert the text in the slide. So go to the insert and you can find the text option here, the text box and the word art. So you can insert the text by using either text box or a word art. So if you go with the text box, click on this text box. So you just drag the text box. The cursor will be appeared here and you can now you can insert the text so you can write the text see hello friends welcome to the sessions on powerpoint presentation right so i have written some two lines and here you can select this one and you can apply the formatting tags, right? Like, see, you can change the font style here. So there are a lot of font styles available here. So you can change the font style according to your uh, interest. And you can increase the font size. See, you can increase the font size, right? And these are the two options to increase and decrease the font size. So this is for increasing the font size. And this is a decreasing for the font size. Right, and this is for clearing all the formats. See the normal text. Okay, so I have changed the format, I have changed the text style, I have changed the font uh, size. And if you apply this one, if you click on this one, it will clear all the formatting tags. Okay, by default, whatever the formatting options are there, that will be applied. Right, so that's the, that's the option here. And the next one is a bold. So you can apply the bold for this one. So automatically the thickness. So based upon your form uh, style, it will be applied. So you have selected this one. That means automatically the text is in bold style. If you select this one, you can see. And if you click on bold, you can see the difference. Right. Some sort of uh, bold is applied for the text. And this is the italic. And all these options we have seen in a word and Excel and this is underline. So underline option will be available here. Right. And shadow. So this is some sort of shadow will be applied for the text. See some sort of shadow is applied and this is a strike through a single strike through will be applied. Single strike through will be applied. And this is for uh, alignment. Okay. Character spacing simply character spacing so very tight so there will be a less space in between a letter to letter and this is tight this is a normal and a loose so there will be a lot of space it's a very very loose if you want to use a customized spacing go with the more spacing and if here you can give the spacing right so that is the spacing option and this is for the sentence the case so sentence case Lower case, all the lower case, all are in the upper case. Capitalize each word and toggle case. Toggle case means wherever the uh, capital letter is there, the small letters will be appeared, and wherever the small letters will be there, the capital letters will be given. And the next one is a highlight net. So this is a text highlight color. So if you select this one, the text will be given a border, right? So you can observe here highlighting, highlighting. And the next one is a font color. So you can the only the font color will be changed. See the background text, the background will not be changed. Only the font color will be changed. If you want to go with the uh, more colors, you can click on this one or eyedropper. So you can select the color, right? So this is the options, the font options. And one more way to create or insert the text is word art. See, there are a lot of styles available here. You can select one style. 
and simply a normal sample text will be here and you can replace the sample text with your own content say i'm writing some sandeep sarad so this is a content and if you want to change the content you can see this is the border this is the border you can apply see the ba background color the color field and this is a white color background and the border is a green color so like this there are different options available so you can select any one among these or you can use the shape fill to shape uh, fill the background color you can select the shape fill to fill the background color if you go with the no fill there will be no no color right if you want to apply the gradients so in the previous session we have seen the gradients right in order to design the slide so we can apply all those gradients and texture so these are all the textures available if you select the texture automatically the background texture will be changed and the shape effects so shape outline so this is outline so this outline means a border so border color no outline or you can give the weight for the border see normally it will be 1 point 1 by 4 per point and if you go with the 6 point it will be there and more lines you can click on more lines you can go with the a different category of lines right and a sketch it so you can apply he apply different styles and also dashed lines you can apply the dashed lines right so like this we can also apply the font outline and we can also go with the shape effects so these are the different shape effects you can give the shadow reflection glow soft edges bevel and 3d rotation you can you simply apply it so that you will be understanding all these things if i select this one so you can see the text will be appear like this so 3d rotation so no rotation i will go with the no rotation and i will uh, i will apply the shadow so some sort of shadow is applied here and a reflection so you can see some sort of reflection is there so like this glow so somewhat the glow will be appeared and soft edges soft edges right you can see the differences so like that we can also apply the effects and the style you can select here see these are all the different styles font styles okay so these are all the different font styles and the colors outline and style so like this we can apply the text right insert the text so two ways we are we, we can insert the text on the slides by using the text box as well as by using the word art right so this is how we can design the content on the slide so let's stop here and if you are having any doubts regarding these two options Feel free to post your doubts in the comment section. Definitely, I will try to clarify all your doubts. And if you really enjoyed my session, like my session, share my session with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thanks for watching. Thank you very much.